What's up everyone? I'm Lex here with Guns and Buns. And today I'm going to be reviewing the Shadow Systems CR920 Elite 9mm pistol. I think it's the perfect combination of power and concealability. We'll talk about that in a little bit. I just want to quickly give a shout out to my favorite gun shop over in Davie, Florida, Buddy's Smoking Gun. They provide me with all of my guns and all of my gun supply needs. So make sure you check them out and follow them on Instagram at the Smoking Gun 954 And when you have some time, head over to their website. They've got a lot of cool things. The link will be down below. I also would like to just go over a few simple safety steps when handling a firearm just to ensure the safety of yourself and the safety of those around you. Starting off with making sure we always keep our firearm pointed in a safe direction. Keep our finger off that trigger. Let's go ahead and make sure that the magazine is empty. And while we're at it, go ahead and double check and verify that the firearm itself is emptied and clear. And now that we got that out of the way, we can talk about the fun stuff. So for those of you that are familiar with the Glock 43, I would use that when referencing the size, weight, and feel of the CR920. Although it is a bit slimmer than the Glock, overall to me it has the same feel. We do have this beautiful extended beaver tail here, and if you guys can see this trigger guard undercut. So for me, what that does is it just kind of nestles perfectly with precision and comfort in my hand. It just has a very natural feel to it. I like it overall and it just feels good. We've got this NPOA backstrap system, which adjusts to match your natural point of aim for enhanced accuracy, along with this wrap around texture grip, which just ensures a secure and slip free grip no matter the weather conditions. So something that I really love about this is this beautiful green tritium night sight, if you guys can see that there, which provides a bright focal point for quicker target acquisition. We've also got this blacked out rear sight, you guys see that there, which enables faster sight picture under stress. So something that's really cool about this as well, and to my knowledge, it's the only one in the industry so far that has this patent pending technology. I wanna make sure I don't mess it up. It is a patent pending multi-optic, multi-footprint optic cut slide. Sorry about that. So basically what that means is you can mount just about any brand of red dot optics directly to the slide without needing plates or adapters. I think that's great. So check out this beautiful barrel here, this fluting pattern on the barrel. It's not just for looks, it does improve debris evacuation, but it also reduces barrel weight for enhanced performance. We've got this flat face trigger, if you guys can see that there, and the proprietary trigger bar, which provide a smooth four and a half to five pound trigger pull and a crisp and tactical reset. Also included with this firearm is the magazine that's in here, which is a 10 round flush fit capacity magazine. And then it comes with a 13 round extended capacity. So I think overall, my opinion of this particular firearm, it's beautiful, it's well-made. It's, uh, I think it's a perfect choice for someone that's maybe in the market for something small and compact and wants to look outside of a Glock or maybe wants to give something, give, give it a try. They've been dealing with Glocks their whole lives and just want to try something different. I would say it's reliable, it's perfect for compact carry, it's concealable, and I just have nothing but good things to say about it. So if you have any experience with this firearm, I'd love to know about it, your likes and your dislikes, please leave it down in the comments. Also, if you like what you see, hit that like and subscribe button, tell a friend, tell many friends, tell everyone, and also, if you guys have any particular firearms that you'd like to see me review, Go ahead and leave those in the comments as well, and I will do my best to make it happen.